back their judgment and as a result took the uh, took the mark on the chest. Been doing it all year and it's surely got to be uh, recognised by all Australian selectors but good start here, the press is on for the Crows. Douglas got it in, a slight fumble, opened the door and that's all Cameron needs! Crowd on their feet and that's why! Through Hardigan initially with the handballs and now they can work along the line. Low ball inside 50 from Brody Smith, getting back to his best form in the last couple of weeks. Hearn, so they try and defend stoutly, and then try, turn it aggressive a few. A couple uh, of fumbles. Yeah, unlikely fumbles from the Eagles. It was Yo, the victim that time. Dangerfield pounce, leads to shoot, and make it two out of two. Henderson, just gave automatically. Laird was involved again in speed. Great kick. Two important players for the Crows and the way they are streaming forward. Lynch connects so often, gets it forward for Benson, keeps on coming. He's got the big man, Jenkins, in the square. He's in the right spot. He's got the mark. And the Crows are going to have their third goal in the blink of an eye. Brilliant ball movement. They're the number one side in the competition that going from back 50 to forward 50, and that is exactly why that ball movement, blokes like Brody Smith, through half back with pinpoint, kicking really open up a defence and Jenkins against Hearn we know how good a player Shannon Hearn is but he's six inches smaller maybe seven inches smaller than Josh Jenkins and Jenkins puts it through and any bets on his own eventually he was spotted had to wait a long time gets there doesn't mark but you can see the recovery was first class left boot Jenkins the sun Barras Jenkins and again, he's in the square, so it's another goal. Well, too big, too strong. It brassed the young fella there. It wasn't really his fault. He was in no man's land, really. But Jenkins just standing up and taking another big grab. Bang, that's four. What a defence. They just watched the ball instead of the man. Powerful kick needed for McGinnity. Good work from Riley Knight getting in there, putting the pressure on. Close to the boundary line. Here's Brady Smith. He's in cracking forces on his own. Yeah, will it get there? Not this time. Oh, it still might. Eddie to the left and the right. Lynch. Yep, that's five. <laughs> oh, exciting. Three crows converge and had it covered. Don't mind that, says the crows fans. As Slide got them going again. Laird there to receive the handball from Knight inside 50. Betts takes it, has a quick glance, open invitation. The pass was on as well. They have got the Eagles second guessing right now. Coping with the added pressure after having been out of this level for the last couple of weeks. Career best seven goals last week. And then Taylor Walker makes it six. Totally They're kicking at 45%, boys. Yeah. West Coast. Henderson now. Here's another one. Eddie's got away again. They have just split this across. The web is basically designed to cover the corridor. They're taking the wide option. They're taking what the Eagles are giving them. But what's happened, Jared? Some of the shocking kicks are splitting open their defence because yep. they're not ready. They're not in they're defensive rebound. mode. They're in attack mode and they're shanking kicks. And he bets. He's been sensational this year. Oh. What a stunning opening call. Going around this Eagles defence. Thompson takes it out to the wing. Van Burlo, the looping handball. Atkins. Jenkins. Yeah, that is copybook ball movement and was, disposal. Went straight across the ground. Really did stretch the defence of the Eagles. And then they found a one-on-one. -on -one, a kid with three games to his name. And uh, Jenkins, who's been in terrific form in recent times. Well, Atkins and Knight have just added that uh, speed through the midfield that they've much dearly needed and really linking up well, but it's Rory led down back, boys, that uh, has had one of the you know best years. He's probably leading the Adelaide best and fairest. He's had 12 touches in his first quarter. The Eagles just have to be a bit mindful of his run from defence. Consistent year from Josh Jenkins. Hasn't been as many big bags of goals. One bag of five. But today could be the day. He's kicked two already. And he goes into quarter time with a third. As this Adelaide Oval erupts one more time. They'll get away with it, There's Brown. No commitment to run, though, from Brody Smith. He's got the pace, and he used it. Walker 
Sends it wide. Jenkins again with the height and experience. He's just too good for Barras. So for four goals, Josh Jenkins. Oh, sublime stuff from the Adelaide Crows. Dominating this game. Jenkins, free. Jenkins wants it up. He wants to jump over Yo. The kick wasn't that well placed for him. Yo Atkins. controlled it, got it down. And Atkins flicks it back and goal! He joins the party. And who better than that man, Dangerfield? Jenkins Crows. is running forward again. And it's Walker. Jenkins He's able to flick on. it off to Cameron. Jenkins is deep. They didn't see him initially. Now they do. Now everyone does. Jenkins takes the mark. And he broke that line magnificently. We were having a laugh last week because he was on his own so many times, yep. Jenkins. He's got these bright orange boots on. They couldn't find him, but today they're standing right out. This for number five. Just rewind the tape to the first quarter. Crows on top again. Jenkins with five. Oh, that's got danger written all over it. Cameron. Got a taste for it. And boy, me, Charlie's done it again. to go Adelaide's way. It hasn't yet. It does now. Oh, oh Walker. Clever. Right spot in the right place. Taylor Walker with just the one goal. Oh. Get it easy. Umpire did not have to move a muscle. Great footy. Cameron tries to get it through. Sloan has a go. Alice, they're all charging in. Bodies everywhere. Ray loves this sort of stuff. Holding the ball. And they've come back. Make that statement. The very first stoppage at the opening bounce of this turn. Oh, Rory Sloan makes it five in this quarter. Jabs at the centre half forward. Hard one to mark. Almost did Riley Knight. Kept it moving anyway. Laird. And then the poking kick in from Atkins is all right. And Tex looks like he's still got the appetite for more shots at goal. So it's been a bit of a struggle in this last quarter. That's a better shot. Works back through the middle. Taylor. I don't know, he got it down, but Douglas had the read on it. Oh, he's. Hunts the back well lines, skims it in towards Dangerfield. He's got oh, it. Here's that goal, Here's goal, Jared. Here's the golden goal. For Adelaide, next best is five for Douglas. Four centre clearances in that first quarter. Comes in Dangerfield. Oh, it's working back. That'll do it. Grimes to a halt. Back into the middle. Dangerfield had a look. That was all Eddie's he needed. And Eddie's waiting. Jenkins is there as well. And he's still waiting. And he scoops it up. Feeds the handball out. And the young man can charge into goal. Riley Knight. Bits from behind. Oh, across the spillage. Cameron. Back to Eddie. They'd love to beat Cahoots for another goal. Eases it into the pocket. And that'll do for Roy. Top. Jericho. Jericho for his six. Yep. The half does for Jenkins. The tackle. The ball's out the back. Thompson knew it. Lynch. Jacobs. Everyone's in. Oh, Eddie. Oh, Eddie. <laughs> oh, Eddie. <laughs> Eddie off the bench. Sure. <laughs> what an incredible afternoon from this club that has been through so much. This team has found a way to get themselves into calculations. They could even be hosting a final this year, and who knows from there. This club has done it before. And what an amazing performance today. The Crows have got home by 57 points and demolished the West Coast Eagles before our very eyes. They're playing footy in September, and who knows how far they can go.